Hello everyone, this is Razor9350, and I'm here to review one of my favorite movies of all time, V for Vendetta. It's a 2006 action romance political movie starring Hugo Weaving and Natalie Portman. The film is loosely based on the 1982 graphic novel of the same name, written by comic book legend Alan Moore. The story follows Evie Hammond, played by Natalie, as she finds herself involved with a plot to rid England of its current totalitarian government system, leading the charge of the mysterious terrorist known only as V, played by Hugo. As far as resembling the source material goes, the opening scene replicates the first pages of the comic book almost exactly, and having seen it after reading the graphic novel, I was duly impressed. But just as the Nightmare on Elm Street remake distanced itself from the original source material, the film adaptation of V for Vendetta gives us an altered storyline, including rearrangements of specific plot points from the novel. But unless you're a super mega hardcore fan looking for a scene-by-scene, -scene, word-for-word adaptation of the original book, this won't do anything to hinder the film for you. The acting in this movie is brilliant. Top-notch. The best performance being Hugo Weaving's portrayal of V. I swear, nobody else could have pulled it off as well as he did. It's like Heath Ledger and the Joker, both memorable, breathtaking performances from two extremely talented actors. Other memorable performances include Stephen Ray as Inspector Finch, John Hurt as Adam Sutler, Stephen Fry as Gordon Dietrich. This is a really good cast. Everyone here brings their all, and it shows. But even with such an outstanding cast, the best part about this movie is its storyline. This is a movie that pulls no punches with the message it's trying to deliver. The whole idea surrounding the plot is summarized in the movie's tagline, Freedom Forever, and that's what V for Vendetta, novel or movie, is all about. If you like political movies, action movies, or just movies in general, definitely check this out. Like it or hate it, you will never forget it. For my final verdict, V for Vendetta gets a 5 out of 5. That's right, a perfect score. Nothing to complain about here, only everything to talk about. I'm Razor9350, and I'll be seeing you later.